What's up, Peak Timers? Phil here from Peak Time Racing. Today, we have got some Hot Wheels color shifters, and we're gonna open them up, and then we're gonna dip them into very cold and very hot water. Let's see what colors they change. All right, guys, to start it off, we've got the Shelby Cobra 427 SC color shifters car. We're gonna go ahead and open this one up. And then we're gonna dip it into the water. We'll dip it into the cold first to see what kind of color it changes, and then we'll dip it into the hot. So here it is. You can see the chrome wheels on here, and this is your color shifters paint on here. And this is kind of just an ugly looking color right now, just to start it off. But we'll see which color it changes. We'll dip half and half here. So we'll go ahead and we'll start with the cold. Right now we'll dip the back half of the cold car. And it doesn't really change like super color in the cold here. Maybe you have to leave it in a little bit longer here. Let's leave it in a little bit longer for that cold water right there. And we'll see if that makes any difference as far as the change goes. And all right, okay. Really not that much of a change. Let's go ahead and dip it into the hot water here. And there we go, there we go. All right, so the hot water makes a little bit more of a difference for this one here. And there we go. It's dripping here. We've got a little towel here. We'll dry it off. So you can see it kind of changes to more of like a, a tannish color or like a whiter tan color right here. And if we dip it in the cold, I wonder if it reverses that. Maybe the cold is what reverses it back to the normal here. Or, I mean, this is, this is science, guys. This is what we're testing out here. All right, so it is the cold that switches it back to the normal color. So that's why it didn't work initially there. So there we go. So you can see it just right there kind of drying. Let's go ahead and just completely dunk it into here. There we go. So we've got it completely dunked into the hot water right there. And we'll go ahead and we'll dry that one off right there. And there we go. So we've got a completely color changed right here. And we'll leave it here for the time of the video here and we'll see if it starts to change back color. But there we go for our first one, our Shelby Cobra. And we'll go ahead and we'll leave that right there. It's just, we can kind of see it as it goes through our video right here. And we've got Chicane as our next one up here, color shifter Chicane. Let's go ahead and pop it open right here. And so we do know that, well, if we dip it in the cold, is it gonna do anything in the cold? It might, maybe it's a different for the different colors, but you can see this one's a darker color. So I wonder if it'll make a difference here. So let's dip it in to our cold water right here. If that doesn't make a difference, then we know we'll just do the hot water first and we'll go back. So, uh, nope, not much of a change right there. We'll dry it off a little bit here and then let's dip it into our, ooh, hot. Definitely makes a huge difference here. Oh, look at that. Look at that, that's a cool looking color here. I actually really, really like that color for the hot right there. Look at that, wow. Okay, let's go ahead and dip it completely in, submerge it, completely change that color right there. There we go. Look at that, wow, that is cool. And you can see even some different graphics and stuff show up on it as well. You can see it's just completely dripping here. We'll wipe it off a little bit right here, there we go. And I like this color. This looks really, really cool. That makes the car look a lot better. Wheels and tires obviously don't change, it's just the color of the car. But that one looks really neat, I like that one. Cool one, all right, that was uh, next one up. We've got the Audacious. Audacious, all right, so this is a similar color to this one when it's dipped, so I wonder what color it will change once we put it into the hot water right here. Let's go ahead and pop it open. We'll skip the the uh, cold water for the time being, and maybe we'll put them at the end. We'll put them all into the cold water, but there we go. Look at the color on this one, and you can see, ooh, is it maybe my, my hands? Yo, you'll see, uh, my hands are a little bit wet, and they get onto this. You can see how it kind of slightly changes the color, so I think it's gonna turn more of a white color here. Let's go ahead and pop it up, and whoa, yes. Definitely completely white on that one. You can see that. That is pretty crazy. All right, I do like that. The white looks pretty good on this one, actually. I like that, I like that. So we can see the, the differences. That's what it kind of used to be, and then we switched it completely to the white. So that, uh, that's that gotta be the, the biggest color change right there out of the ones that we've put in so far. There we go, we'll go ahead and throw that one right there. We'll see if it slowly starts changing back. I wonder, is the Cobra changing back? I think the Cobra is changing back to its original color here quite a bit more than what it used to be. What do you guys think here? So if we put the Cobra into here, no, it's still kind of changing back. So let's dip half the Cobra into there. There we go. So half the Cobra is dipped back 
right there so you can see it kind of changing here we'll dip it back there we go we'll cl completely whiten the cobra up there there we go we'll put that one back and we'll go next up we've got the dodge viper Ooh, this one might be a big color change look at that cool graphics and stuff for color shifters dodge viper let's go ahead and open up the Viper and see what this one does right here. My hand's still a little bit wet, so let's just completely dunk it first right in. This is kind of like a greenish color to start it off. Let's see what color it changes when we put it into the warm. Ooh, okay, okay. Very, very kind of like an off-white color, not as white as the previous car here. There we go. Look at that. Okay, that's a nice off-white color for that one here. Almost yellowish. We got even some different pinstriping that shows up on the side. Let's kind of dip it half and half here. Let's go half and half on this one here. There we go. Ooh, look at, see, it kind of, it was originally a little bit lighter. Now it goes a little bit darker color. So now let's leave this one on like a two-tone. There we go. And let's see how fast this one changes back right here. There we go. All right, we got the two-tone color on the Viper. I'm gonna draw my hands off as much as possible on this little towel right here. And then we'll open up our last uh, one here, which is the Cockney Cab 2. There we go. All right, so this one looks like a, uh, it's like a taxi, I guess it would be. The cab taxi would be. And this one's a very dark color. So let's go ahead and open this one up. And my this hand is still a little bit wet here. So let's go ahead and use my left hand right here, which is a little bit drier. And we'll have a look at it. So it does say taxi on the side of it. And it's got maybe slightly different colors on the side than it is on the top. I wonder if this full thing is color changer or if only like a little bit of it is. All right, let's go ahead and dip it. Okay, okay, is anything changing? I don't really see much that's, oh yes, look at the, the side, the complete side turns yellow. There we go, okay, I see. So the top and all that doesn't change. All right, so if we can see that, so it's hard to see, it's hard to see. I mean, you almost like might have got a little bit confused at first, but you can see how it completely changed to taxi on the side. And now if we dip it in, so watch this whole side piece right here. That's all yellow right now. Let's go ahead and dip it in here and leave it in there for a second and there we go so you can see now that's completely changed to like more or less a darker greenish color i would say you can see that right there let's go ahead and dip it half and half let's do a half and half on this one as well and we can see what this one's all about there we go okay okay there we go so there we go we got the half and half of this taxi right here, which looks pretty neat. I like that. All right, we'll go ahead and put that one down. The one thing I wanna go back to, I think we haven't touched either of these two. How much has this one dried out and gone back to its regular color right here? Let's go ahead and see. I think it's still kind of the same color. Let's see, if we dip it in the, the hot water right here. No, nope, that's kind of the same. We'll dip it in, we'll give it a half and half. Oh yeah, big difference, big, big difference on this. You can see the definite cold that brings it back to its original color and it's the warm that brings out that color changer on there very very cool very neat i really really enjoy these color changer cars let's half and half this one as well there we go look at that that's that's like that's got to be the biggest difference it looks like we're just dipping it in paint there you go look at that all right so there we go color changers guys what do you guys think of these color changer hot wheels cars i think they're pretty neat i think they're pretty fun to play around with guys you guys let me know in the comments section down below let me know which one was your favorite make sure you guys hit that thumbs up and i'll catch you guys on the next one Bye bye